Hello world, what's going on? My name is Castle Perfect, and yes, I know guys, it's been like a whole entire month since I, since my last upload, but let me tell you something, I'm not going to bore you with all the details, I'm just going to tell it to you straight, a whole month away abroad on holidays, and then when I returned, I had to move from apartment A, where I was first, to apartment B, where I am right now. Am I already established in the sense of everything has its place now, and I can continue to live stream and upload videos frequently again not necessarily but i'm trying my absolute best to do everything again i'm solo no 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 support so i need to like you know <laughs> keep it up because i also have a whole career next to this uh hobby that i have uh, of creating content for you guys here on youtube regardless i did not miss a single seven star raid boss ever since i was away i did take my switch with me and i played around a little bit and yes i did get myself the incineroar the dragonite and all those other pokemon with the mightiest mark now from today which is the 20th of uh september we have a brand new seven star raid boss which is none other than superior and for this specific pokemon i really just wanted to make a video because now i am um, you know set up a little bit to the point where i can start creating videos again now obviously this is not what we all want it's another starter we would love legendaries etc but it is what it is so from today 20th until uh, the day after tomorrow which is sunday the 22nd we have superior in seven star raid dance with the moves leaf storm gastro acid dragon pills iron tail and additional moves sweet sand breaking swipe and glare obviously with the mightiest mark cannot be shiny and has its stereotyping set to grass it comes at a level 100 and it has its hidden ability contrary which is in my personal opinion one of the most interesting uh, uh, hidden abilities that are in the game because everything that happens the opposite is true its nature is going to be modest, no health item, only once, you, you can only catch only one uh, per save file, and it has some, of course, scripted actions, uh, such as, for example, when the battle starts, and I'm taking this information from Cerebi.net, for those of you who don't know, um, so, scripted actions are um, sweet scent at 99% of time remaining, so basically at the start of the battle, uh, that basically lowers your evasiveness, therefore, uh, leaf storm which has a lower accuracy will hit you 100 percent of the times unless you do something about it of course then we have that 85 percent we have the player stat and status reset so you should not be setting up until the 85 percent time remaining mark has passed then at 84 percent which is one percent less superior uses break and swipe which drops your attack stats just keep that in mind and then the other scripted uh, actions are it reduces your terror orb charge at 75 percent and it also activates uh, its shield at the same time or just vice versa regardless they are uh, combined it's just a sequent, uh, sequence of moves and then at 60 percent uh, superior stats and status reset so basically all the debuffs and all the stuff that uh, you probably got on superior will be taken off and then the last scripted action is going to be glare it's gonna try to paralyze you at 40%. Now, one of the beautiful things about Superior is that it gives us the TM-159, uh, which is Leaf Storm, by the way. So if you really were looking for one like that, this is definitely your chance. And uh, this one drops Calcium. So if you wanna farm some Calcium, you can definitely do that. And uh, yeah, so that's basically it. For now, the one counter that I'm going to be using for this Pokemon is a Delphox. And obviously, Delphox is not a naturally um appearing pokemon in scarlet and violet unless you have of course the dlc expansion uh, but if you don't have the dlc expansion you can also use pokemon home to transfer it all the way down to pokemon scarlet and violet and if you don't have that then i just really pray to arceus that you have a friend or two that can actually gift you one of these so starting off my counter here is delphox at level 100 its stereotyping is set to fire it has a clear amulet because we don't want our uh, evasiveness to drop as it is one of the scripted moves that uh, superior does and uh, so its moves are mystic uh, mystical fire calm mind skill swap and wish which is fantastic we're gonna need that now obviously um the ev spread here is going to be 252 defense 128 special attack and 128 special i mean uh, hp um so basically that's that's it and its ability i mean I, its nature is actually um it says not here but i changed it 
uh, to modest um, and that's basically it so this is going to be by the way the first time that I'm gonna try this I saw um, content online of the specific build and I thought oh wow that was quite interesting so I should definitely go ahead and at least give it a try it seems like it has a 100% uh, chance of actually succeeding so I think it's gonna be a uh, pretty good usually i think of my own sets but you know uh, since i'm very short on time it is unfortunately the way that we are going to uh, deal with this so here it is face the mightier superior great and all so let's go ahead and uh, see if we can find one on the map uh it's right there i think that's that's it so it's a black warp so that's really nice um, mm, um i didn't really break down exactly what the move sequence is uh, but but you'll definitely see soon enough ba -ba 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 -ba. just also really um really hoping that uh soon we'll have some legendaries coming back to pokemon scarlet and violet such as the mewtwo that we had one time in the past which i 100 percent missed and never got a chance to do it again uh, or redo unfortunately but uh, yeah really really hoping for that to happen at some point in the near future uh, but it is what it is for now right it is what it is so we're just gonna jump ahead here uh, into the raid and I'll see you guys there Alright, so here we are. Um, I found the uh, Black Orb, and uh, this is a period. Let's see how we fare. It seems like whenever you're using Dale Fox, you don't really have to worry too much about anything, basically, because uh, the chances of you actually failing this is extremely low. Uh, obviously, if you have the sequence wrong, it could eventually affect your the outcome completely, but um i don't think it's going to be too problematic we're about to find out whether or not uh, this strategy actually works so let's see what uh, what this guy has in store let's see all right so we got hero cross hexorus and duden spars as our teammates all right so first things first it's gonna go for the yeah the the sweet scent as expected all right our evasiveness well He's not going to drop because of the clear amulet, so that works. We're gonna start off the battle by using skill swap. We want to get rid of that ability of curse because that thing is really problematic. Otherwise, that plus six is going to be very, very devastating, and we just we really don't want to deal with that uh, anytime soon. So for now, we're just gonna take away her ability and we're gonna give it back Blaze. Now, obviously, because we have contrary, the last thing you want to do is use Calm Mind. So. What we're gonna do is we're gonna set up with uh, mystical fire. There's three mystical fires uh, in sequence, um, especially because we need to build some energy and we need to crystallize at some point as well. So in comes the uh, leaf stone again. Now because we took away its hidden ability, it's not going to get that special attack raise. Instead, it actually gets what it deserves, which is the special attack drop. And by the way, that's drastic drop, uh, which means two stages. Now, Mystical Fire also drops the special attack, so it's it adds on. It's great. It's it's amazing. So we're gonna go for another Mystical Fire here. She is paralyzed, which is great. Um, all done by getting sparse. And uh, yeah, we're looking pretty good right now. So in comes the Leaf Storm again, and again, it's just really killing its own special attack at this point. Which is, <laughs> I mean, you can do that all day, baby. Let's go. All right, in comes the Shield, and as we know. Is gonna nullify our statue in this. So now it's very important that you do not forget that you have contrary. You took contrary away from this Pokemon. So do not set up just yet. Don't do that, brother. Do not do that. Now, one of the things you, what you should do here is you should terrestrialize and skill swap into something else. So 
what should we take here we should take the sparse uh, ability i have no idea which one that is but we're just gonna do it with the sparse here we need to get rid of Conquery here, otherwise our Tall Mind is going to have the opposite effect, so instead of increasing our special defense and special attack, it's actually going to drop that. We don't want that. Alright, so let's see. Iron Tail, it's, it's, it's resisted, I'm purely fire, and uh, yeah, I'm going to skill swap that with Dudden Spars, and what ability did I get actually? I didn't even notice. It doesn't even say though. That's interesting. Alright, so but does it show now? Oh, I have Serene Grace. Uh, that's that's interesting, because if I use uh, Mystical Fire, it's going to drop a special attack a little bit more. So now we're going to... Um, we're quite low on HP, as you can clearly see. So we should uh, heal up now. Why not? Let's do that. We are uh, we're in the red zone. We don't want to die here. i to make sure we stay alive, because otherwise the whole premise of this build is going to be compromised. Especially because I'm already terrestrialized. You can clearly see what my HP bar is. I need to like get the green screen a little bit. See, I'm still not set up properly, but it is uh, like I really bear with me here. I'm gonna go for the Calm Mind here. I have a decent amount of HP. The point where I think that I can live through it. I had like 93 HP uh, just now. Um, let's see how much do I have now. So I need to make sure I don't die here. Because otherwise I'm not gonna be able to terrestrialize again. So I have 66. That's pretty okay. I already used Wish. Uh, we're gonna call mine once more. And Iron Tail is actually going to miss. That's amazing. That's great. So in comes Call Mind. Now what you wanna do here is you wanna call mine six times. You wanna set up just to the absolute max and have Wish heal you up. Alright. Uh, wait, I didn't use Wish. I'm, I'm going nuts. <laughs> I used the heal up, sorry. Uh, a little bit getting a little bit distracted here. All right, there is the wish. Um, I think I'm going to have to use another heal up just to make sure that I don't die. Yeah, 38%. I mean, 38 HP remaining is not good. I'm going to heal up here. Um, I am messing up the sequence myself, uh, but it's all good. Like I said, um, the chances of you actually messing up this raid are very slim, especially with this build, because you basically resist everything that this superior has to dish out. So it's great. And you cripple it like absolutely with the uh, mystical fire and uh every other move that we have used so far we're back to almost full hp which is great now we can continue the calm mind and uh as soon as we reach um plus six special attack uh, we can actually uh move on and uh attack with uh mystical fire the thing with mystical fire also is is you need to be careful because it only has 10 power points um, I didn't use any PP up, um, so we really need to be maxed out before we start using those again. We don't want to run out of power points because we don't have any other offensive move to use uh, in the meantime. So that could be very, very detrimental. So we're still in the green, which is great. I'm going to open another Calm Mind that's going to bring us to plus 5 special attack and plus 5 special defense, if I'm not mistaken. Um, so we do one more after this, and then it's uh, it's basically time to just go for the uh, for the offensive here. All right, let's see. Yep, it's looking pretty good. Plus five, both stats. One more calm mind, and I'm maxed out. And the great thing also is that uh, Iron Tail also has uh, low accuracy, so it actually can miss quite often. Um, if of course the AI decides to be very unlucky. Uh, all right, so we're maxed out now. Uh, we can essentially just use the last cheer up go all out just for a little bit of more damage output. Now keep in mind, uh, there is no more scripted actions that are going to reset your stats, so that's great. Uh, so ability was suppressed, that's totally fine. I don't really care. And now we're gonna fire off mystical fires until we actually win this battle. But um, also keep an eye out for your health, because some shenanigans could definitely happen to the point where you may be critted one, two, maybe three times. I know it's very unlikely for that to happen, but I have seen it, it happening to people, happening it to me. So when that happens, well, there is basically not much that you can do, you know. Um, RNG can be a bitch sometimes. So Mystical Fire dealing massive amount of damage. We are reaching the timer. Which is great, and now we are paralyzed. That's not good. 
That is not good, which is by the way, it's a scripted one uh, at 40%. We already knew that. So she is going to go for the dragon pose. I want to go ahead and check out my HP. I'm still at a decent level here. I could go either for a wish or just go for the offensive. And I just really want to finish off this battle. So I'm just going to go for the mystical fire. And uh, go bam, we are uh, past the timer. Uh, so that's great. Uh, let's see just how much HP we have left. Okay, we are in trouble here. We need to finish this really fast. As soon as we just break the shield, we don't necessarily have to die. Again, I kind of messed up the sequence. But as soon as the shield goes down, uh, we're safe. We're safe. I mean, it's GG will play. Look at this. I could get paralyzed again, and RNG could definitely mess it all up. But I just trust that I have good karma today. <laughs> so how much HP do we have left? We literally have 50, 15 HP left. I think we died, right? Uh, there is not much else we can do here. Oh, and I get paralyzed at the very end. Oh, what an A. I still have three power points, though. Oh, Iron Tail. Is that going to take me out? I think it will. Oh, yeah, it will. Okay, all right. I know. You're not supposed to faint, though. Again, I completely messed up the sequence, but it's completely fine because, like I said... Uh, ooh, wait a second. That's not good. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, we lost the plus six everything, right? Uh, but we have three more, three more attacks left, and I, I'm not gonna be paralyzed anytime soon anymore. So, so it, it should be fine. Fire, let's go fire here. Let's go, baby. We need to finish this. Iron Tail actually misses, and uh, yep, he needs to go fire. Bam. Okay, now, nah. <laughs> perfect. <laughs> and that was a crit. Yeah, that's what you get. That's definitely what you get. So this was my very first try with this build. Like I said, even when you mess up the move sequence, you can still win. And there are definitely other Pokemon that are way more, uh, you know, effective against Superior. But we're gonna definitely find out as time progresses what builds are more optimal. Uh, but for now, I'm just going to, yeah. What do I catch this thing in? Actually, Netball maybe. Hold on. Hmm. The mightiest mark one uh, i'm just gonna throw a dust ball i don't know why but i feel like dust ball is i don't have more special balls so i guess that's what it is <laughs> i'm gonna catch it in a dust ball here and we are going to you know check out the rewards we get at the very end obviously i already mentioned those partially at the very start of the video uh but i think the most important thing that you should uh take into account is the fact that you can form calcium you're gonna get the tm 159 which is leaf storm and it can also drop ability patch if that's something you're looking for we are extremely lucky here we got actually four herba mystica obviously super important to note you can also get those in these raids uh five calcium tm 159 leaf storm and a ability patch some grass terra shards and obviously a bottle cap some nuggets and exp candy guys that's it for this video i want to thank you so 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 much for those of you who have been patient with me there will be more com content coming your way um very soon but i'm still trying to push forward with all the responsibilities that i have in my personal life and uh, uh just a quick reminder it is still a hobby of mine to do this it is not priority one and the reason why that is is because it doesn't pay my bills so just being honest and uh but 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 i'll be back i'll be back very soon again and uh yeah thank you so much for watching remember to hit the like button help me out we need to reach that level where i can be consistent i'm also going to get some editors also on board so it should be very very good moving forward so that's basically it for my side guys thank you very much my name is castle perfect and i'll see you guys very very soon take care